My name is Rob Stafford. I'm from Honeywell Turbo Technologies or Garrett Turbo Chargers. I'm the Performance Product Manager for Australia. We're here today at SEMA. It's always a good show and that's why we release our product here. Always an exceptionally good show for us. We've made some upgrades to our GT3035 series. Um, they, we've now they are called Gen 2 series. We've also made the reverse rotation for GT30 and 35s. It's a compressor wheel upgrade across the board. They've basically given the, uh, the flow map a broader range, just improved the performance across the board. And as you rightfully pointed out, it is in line with current requirements for the tuners. We've tidied up the housing castings, made them far more attractive than they were. Also added uh, a threaded hole for speed sensor uh, fitment. Well, as I say, GTX 3584R. It's a complete new design. It's basically the same packaging size as the, as the old GT 35s have been, 82s, but with up to a thousand horsepower capability. So yeah, very good. Very, a small turbo with big horsepower potential. Cars have been received very well. We've got a Mazda FD series over here that's um, uh, in the build, which is good. A lot of uh, what's happening is exposed before it's covered with sheet metal or, fi uh, or carbon fibre. It's four wheel drive, quad rotor uh, with a Garrett turbocharger on it, creating a lot of interest. We also have a, a Porsche in the back here that's been retrofitted with a Garrett turbocharger and a 1500 horsepower Camaro. So the idea of putting the two turbos on was actually my idea. We had a project that we wanted to do at Pikes Peak and for Pikes Peak you need a lot of horsepower. So we uh, this was the obvious choice which was to boost it up to about 1400 horsepower which takes forced induction, lots of it. <laughs> 